Johan, congratulations with what you have achieved with the carnival diet. Johan started in December and his goal was to lose 35 kilos and he already lost 26 kilos. Uh, the previous message that uh, the one on top you can see there was in February and he already lost 14 kilos by, by that time and the centimeters came down by 23 centimeters and his blood, blood glucose was stable and he mentioned there is something about um, his blood gl glucose going slightly higher. Um, uh, there's a video about that, um, Johan, if you check on my Frequently Asked Question playlist, uh, it is Q39. I talk about higher glucose levels on the carnivore diet. That video is in Afrikaans, unfortunately for my English-speaking um, friends. Uh, but there's a video on my blog in English, um, video 126, where Dr. Kendi Berry talks about higher glucose levels on the carnivore diet. Uh, I'm not going to talk about that right now, otherwise the time will will be up, but check it out, Q39 on my Frequently Asked Question playlist on my YouTube channel, or else video 126 on my blog. If you click the photo profile, you'll find my blog link, carnivoreway.blogspot.com. Johan, again, congratulations with what you have achieved, man, and it's only a pleasure, and thank you for your friendship and your contribution and sharing this information with us 26 kilos and you feel like a new person um, you are inspiring somebody else to look at the carnivore diet discuss it with their doctor i'm going to have an interview with a medical professional next weekend um, i'll give you the exact time it will be saturday or sunday um, it's eric i've tagged him in this video it's Nurse Eric. He's a professional nurse in America. And um, I'm looking forward to that particular interview. He's one year on the carnivore diet. And I'm so excited always when I talk to medical professionals who do the carnivore diet because we need people like that. Um, so, Eric, if you see this, I'm looking forward to our live on TikTok next weekend. And uh, thank you for doing this. And Juan, again, thank you so much for sharing this information of your progress with us.